Okay, so here I have completed sewing the rest of my circuits together and next I'm going to upload the programming language to my lily pad so that all of my lights light up. To do so, I need two things. I need the FTDI basic breakout board as well as a USB cable. Here's the completed sketch for the door sign. In the setup, I've added pin modes for pin 7, 9, 11, and 13. In addition, I had to program pin 9 and 13 as the negative sides of the circuit by assigning them a digital right of low. In the loop part of the sketch, I assigned pins 7, 9, 11, and 13 as either on or off, high or low. Next you go up here and click the verify. This will compile your sketch and make sure that you do not have any errors. There are two things now you need to do before you upload your program to your lily pad. You need to go to tools, go to board, and then make sure that you have the correct lily pad Adreno board selected. Next, you're going to go to Tools again, select Serial Port, and, and make sure that your highest numbered port is selected. Now I'm going to plug the breakout board into the lily pad. Next, you go to Upload, and then look for your lights on the lily pad and the breakout board. You'll notice there'll be several lights on the Adreno board, as well as the breakout board, indicating that it's uploading the programming. And now, as you can see, I have all my lights lit up.